be anything else while you were outside. Yeah. He said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore. That the Giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. Do you think he knows all the Giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? What happened here? So close to home. I'm ready to warring with one another now. Those are not their arrows. Something else is out here. Gonna need another path to the temple. Why would you come out this way alone, lad? I had dreams calling me here. <sighs> dreams. Hey, try using your blades to pull this down. Please. <laughs> Whoa, that one's still alive. No, look closer. Ah, Hell Raiders now? Who's doing this? Suppose it's too much to hope that an enemy of theirs would be a friend of ours. Yeah, probably. Hell, brother. Something what was that? strong and dangerous. Be on guard. Oh yeah, be all the way on guard. Nista. Behind you, brother. Got him. Remember when I said there was someone who might help us answers about the giants and Loki? You mean Tyr, the old god of war in these lands, who is dead? Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty keen on seeing he wasn't found. Right? He knows Tyr could unite the realms against him. Plus, Tyr was the giant's greatest ally. So... Enough. Imagine what the lads found, but he says he has evidence. We've come this far. Let's see it. Too late. Lisa! Bob, get your blade! Burn that! Raider, on the left! 
Nice how Fimble Winter wore down all the helpful magic we acquired. Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. <laughs> 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 gotten rather good at that. <sighs> Yet another grisly scene. I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one morning. Oh no! Brother! Oh! 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 
On your guard, brother. I think we found our predator. <laughs> 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 The torch is glowing. Might be a weak point. Winter Freya, the raiders torn out and barging in, and now stalkers playing in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. You watching? new. Come on. Atreus, wait! Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. What is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here, inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati, the wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. 
not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then, the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse? I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mimir, can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time. Or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait! I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. What is this? Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No. I found it in one of the other shrines. Other shrines? How many have you visited? I... well... all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard, anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned. But I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. They mention... black smoke and the bleeding earth. But... We can never figure out exactly... We? Yeah, Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. it. It wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muspelheim? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the Bleeding Elf? Sounds like a mine, aye. Uh, the realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Svartalfheim, that's a good bet. Their mines did belch black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it, then. Tears in Svartalfheim somewhere, imprisoned in a mine? So? What now? This way. Lad, even if we consider looking for Tyr, how do you have us getting to Svartalfine? You know Odin's had all travel between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. First troll out this way? I remember you lost control. We must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. You okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. No! Brother, there's no blocking without your shield! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Nisto! Watch the fire! to smashing through things for fun and profit. Lovely. <laughs> Stepped outside. But he told us about it. I wouldn't worry. What about the things he did not tell us? Phew! Almost home. Brother, a word. Don't hold the lad's curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, and smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. Sentry! As I live and breathe, is that Atreus? It's been so long. How you've grown! Uh, well, yeah. Hmm. Well, if you'll follow me, Brock mentioned you needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. After you, my friends. Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. Remember, we don't have the Unity Stone to let us jump off, right? Of course he remembers! Huh. Right, brother? Of course I remember. As you can see, we've settled here in the Realm Between Realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimblewinter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. 
Intriguing. Right this way, Kratos. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay, then. Your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any... Anybody need a snack? Kratos? Snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's... What? It it's okay. I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son and disobeyed me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. N nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... something we needed your help with. Oh! The Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! Not so fast. How'd that get in here? What the hell is it anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. And he looks like that. I blame you. Now, well, come on then. Let's get him something that fits at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey. I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivant. Do you know this? Mmm. Busted up good. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? I tossed him in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look around, check out my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready. How's life been treating everyone's favorite as your Vulgarian? The fuck you call me? <laughs> Exquisite. Finding everything all right, I hope? How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. Uh, yeah. So. Where exactly is Tyr being held? He's imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader? Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you? You just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will he help us or not? Oh, never mind. 
It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine! Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. We'll just need the Bifrost in the head. Brock? Do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, I... Uh... Do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, a stodding bastard! <laughs> open, open now! I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it! <laughs> oh! That's it! That's it. Good. Now, release! Still unpleasant. Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry. I'm coming, I'm coming. Russell goes, eggs, man. What was that for? You'll see soon enough. You need to adjust. Oh, there. That should do it. See? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck. Gritos, throw me at him. Horns first! <laughs> Guess it takes a joke, you old goat. <laughs> the Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first, come on, let me show you how it works. Okay, aim your key at the room for Svartalfheim on the right, then concentrate. To get to any of those realms, you'll need a seed for them. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the Grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! Feel that? What's that lad? Anything. Everything. It's warm. Uh, Careful, uh, lad. Ah! Why are these things so fast? Behind you, brother! Ah! I 
see we're already off to a lively start. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have covered that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. There are resources. If you never asked Mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. <laughs> so these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. <laughs> if only we were in Midgard. That water would be frozen in a second. Ah! Oh! Tyr was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the Rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. way to turn the wheel up here. Snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. 
An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spatelfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Think we can fit under that bridge? Cap those geysers? Hmm. hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. Do you really think Odin would honor his end of the deal? That if we keep our distance, he'll leave us alone? No. That does not mean I intend to fight him. Perhaps we find a new home, where neither he nor Freya can trouble us. But... once we find Tyr, he can help us fight. Fight? 
That's, uh, not what I meant. Obviously, we have so much to learn from Tyr. Any way he can help us is good, right? Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. <laughs> you did it. Let's see what it dropped. Halfway there. There's gotta be another tree to lower the rest of the gate. That grim's find a patch on high! Try hitting the rope holding the block. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Can you see anything from that block? Jump! That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Lad, if I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well... Like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tears in a talkative mood after being in prison for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. First because of Fimblewinter. Maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. Might be onto something, lad.
Atreus. Look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellir, brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. An alarm. I only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. Definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Hey, yeah. can we talk to we you don't for? We don't want any trouble, please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. And hope they let us in. What is a dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oof, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material... Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something... Uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it? What's it gonna be this time? Patience. I find it's best to see these things oh, in action. Ah. Whew. There. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say, Ski Alpha. Well, I certainly didn't expect you to trip half the creepy crawlies you need them here. How was I supposed to know they were there? Are you left? Find you! Incoming! Okay, so, Derlin. Atreus, this 